Hi, I'm Daniel Watt from Yamaha and I'm here today with the Tyros Tipsters and we're going to talk a little bit about Organ World which is brand new on Tyros 5. It's a fantastic new feature, anything to do with the organ world in, effectively is all under this one button called Organ World. So if I just push that, the first thing that we now see on the screen is we've got a set of draw bars but this is a vintage, it's a Hammond type instrument from the 60s and the 70s, we've got live draw bars directly beneath the screen and any sound that we want is there. Now one of the great things with all the Hammonds was, obviously you've got all the draw bars that you've got infinite amounts of settings on, but if you don't know exactly which draw bars to pull out to make that unique combination of sounds that you want for that one particular piece of music. The original Hammonds on the bottom keys of the top keyboard and the lower keyboard, the keys were the wrong way around. So the white keys were black and the black keys were white. And what these were were registrations effectively. They each one of those keys locked down and they were the famous settings that that instrument was famous for. We've done that here. So if I just use the D button to move across from footages to presets, so just one button, and you can see we've now got these eight reverse keys, and these are literally just drawbar registrations. So if you want to, you can literally just, if you don't know any of the drawbar things at all, you can literally just play off these registrations. So let's just pop a little audio jazz swing on. Now the nice thing is, whereas with the old Hammonds, you had no idea what that drawbar combination was, if we just move across to the footages, again using the D button, we can see exactly what that combination is. So let me go back to presets. If I press preset 4, any one of these are registrations or presets for that organ sound. I then come across to footages, I can see exactly what that drawbar is. That's a great, great facility for, and it helps you to learn which drawbars are going to sound good together. Rotary, or the fast to slow speed between the drawbar sound, is controlled by a button C on the screen here. We've got a nice picture of the old toggle switch, is exactly how it used to be on a Hammond. Or I can use the variation button on the panel to do exactly the same thing. But because that's a little bit too far over to the right, I can program the foot switch to do that as well. So I've got that facility as well. As well as the vintage organ, which we've just been showing you, um, if I use these tab buttons just on the right hand side of the screen, I can move to the home. So now we've got the Lowry, which is um, a tab organ rather than being a drawbar organ. Lowry's never had drawbars, they always had on off tabs for each of the footages. And again, rotary. And again, if we want to see a presets of that, we can actually go to presets and we've got eight presets for that as well. The next organ that we have is a Euro organ. Now, this is the organ that I grew up with, as well as playing Hammonds back in the 80s and the 90s. I played a lot of years on Verzi instruments, and that's what we've got here. We've got an old Verzi Helios, so we've got that sound that Klaus was famous for. And again, we've got the presets to get those famous sounds. So you can play just a play away on just on the on the presets alone. And the final one I want to show you is the concert organ which we're all very very proud of at Yamaha. So if we just move the tab across one more time to concert We've now got the beautiful concert organ.
just a little bit of a quick snippet of what you can do within Organ World. Hope that's been of use to you.